Welcome back to Ravenport and whoops that's the wrong button let's get this one there we go uh, let's um, okay you're slide that over you are oh I say a couple days of being done we can always check the uh, growth map later on and ooh this field will be done next time we sleep nice okay cool uh, let's check the calendar yep a couple days before the canola is done uh, the barley is going to be done in June so unless come on down there we go. Uh, I, um, mm, no. I'll leave that fertilizing contract alone for the moment. Um, okay, we still have a $500,000 loan. We did spend uh, quite considerable. Sorry, that was my chair squeaking. Uh, considerable amount. And I just can't remember. Um, yeah, the majority of our fields are down here besides the one that we created up here which is next to the farm production yay um anyhow um yeah that's our front door okay uh let's sleep and then we'll get the barley harvest done okay let's run over here to the harvester and it's really not gonna take like a super huge amount of time trust me well, it's because all we really got to do is go down one side and come back a sliver and we'll be done but right now the field is not saying it's done but we can get over there whoops that was the corn header now we can go around this trailer Yeah, as you can see, it's not really done yet, because the... Oh, that updating line hasn't come through yet. Hurry up, updating line. Where you at? Oh, it's coming through right now. Cool. Nice. Sweet. Uh, let's see. How about we switch to the header and unfold it first? There we go. Lower and turn on. And like I said, this is not... This really needs to actually, like, not keep resetting the straw dropping option there. Alright. Well, we do have some straw anyway, so... Oh yeah, so we need to, to also collect the trailer to get the eggs over to the um, pr farm production. Are you straight? Whoops, that is the wrong way to turn. Can I do 
attached there. Thank you. Anyhow, let's get these over to the silo. Alright, when this folds up, we can fold up the harvester. Alright, now we can grab the Massey. We can come over here to the chickens. Uh, drop some food in. I wish this was also like FS23. You can just drive by and the trailer would just automatically uh, do whatever, like dump food or whatever. Yeah, I wish it did that here too. Alright. Let's grab the trailer. Oh, we got more honey to move over. Yay, that's a joy. Uh, no Silas just yet. Okay. I think we have just about 150,000 liters of silage in the uh, silo there. I know it's over 140. But we're going to get these eggs loaded, get them over the farm production, and whatever's not being used can get sold. The eggs are loaded up and we are heading out to the farm production and I don't know if it's going to take all of these or not but we'll see when we get out there. Yay! We do have some extra. We can take them to the beach restaurant. Uh, but probably just like the bakery it probably won't take all of them but we'll see well here's the odd part on the way here I almost had another crash clip for you know another compilation a video crash video and I'm like okay cool I avoided it so okay that just denied the clip right there right I come crawling down and I get so immersed there's a train coming by so I got that um, I didn't leave it in the video by the way and uh, 50,443 pounds nice okay but anyways I come up on the I was immersed with the train being on the uh, rails there so I was following it along you know and I'm going down the road I'm watching it unbeknownst to me the gate was still down so all of a sudden my tractor stops and the tail end just kind of jerks around. I hit the guard I hit the guardrail for the crossing. So yeah, there's so I avoided one crash, so that wasn't going to be part of anything and I crashed into another. So yeah. I still got a clip for the crash compilation. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm saying that word right, but I'll see y'all at home. Let's park this down here. Let's get up and start moving that honey around. Because I do not know honestly do not know how many pallets we have oh 
Uh, bear with me one second. I gotta check something here. It still may be a couple weeks out yet. Maybe a week. Because this video will be going up if I am correct. This video, you guys will see this video uh, on November 13th. And if I remember, that's if I remember correctly. According to my video list, it will be November 13th when you guys see this video. And right now, I'm recording this on November 3rd. Kind of doing that play on uh, having three or four episodes of Ravenport back and forth. I mean, since with Construction Simulator, I'm taking all those, I'm taking uh, a single job, and depending on how big they are, ooh, you're just a half a pet. We only got what two or three, really? Only like two or three pet. Okay, well, I mean, I'll take it. Um, you good right here for a second? All right, cool. But um, now where am I going? But um, anyway, so yeah, um, construction simulator. I'm taking a job, depending on how big it is, and breaking it down to like two, three, four parts, however how many. Grass is still growing, which is awesome. So that means the other grass field over there is still growing. I don't know, maybe one more time of sleeping we can get this harvested too. I say harvested because it's in the field, but cut. Mode, bay, you know, yeah, cut mode. Yeah, mm -hmm. two of the same thing. Cut mode, bailed, and wrapped up, whatever. Um... If any of you understood that jibber jabber, I thank you very much. Um, what do our other fields look like? I'm still trying to think of something to do here besides sleep and uh, getting ready to do something else. Uh, 14 even though it's 14 and 15 I'm still still I'm still gonna call it 14 like I've been saying uh, maybe another maybe another couple days just as with our field up here um, and since this is canola that canola can go to the production over here. Um, the wheat, of course, is going to be going into the silo for the chicken. Whoop, those, yeah, wrong section. For the uh, chicken feed. Uh, canola here can go to our oil factory over here. We have oats here and here, which could be taken over to the farm production for. Uh, making bread turning into flour then making bread and I'm pretty sure we still don't have a direct cedar which is okay now before I get going into that uh, more soybeans oh which reminds me we got that garden um, yeah, let's go grab the Massey. We used, uh, we used Junior here last time. Yeah, let's use this one. So let's get out there and see how many 
pallets of soybeans we got. And if the hay is done fermenting, well then we can bring a, bring a load over here for these two mixers. Okay, looks like we still got water. Yep, just, well, 137,000 liters, so these are 1,000 liters each. And we only have three of them this time, but it actually would make a good question when are so I was going to ask when soybeans are best but I think it still could be right right now in June so let's get these back to the silo get the total number of what we have because I know it's going to be a couple trips for the uh, for junior there and I really don't want to take the massive one because that's not really gonna I don't know it's such a big capacity and we're carrying so little but I don't want to take the little trailer and then have two or three loads just get it all in one load there you go I don't see the harm in that okay yeah we'll get the big trailer we'll dump this off grab the big trailer and take everything to the cell phone well we can take everything to grain elevator west since it's well over the 3400 pounds that is shown to be the top mark there so I'm pretty sure I've been out that way before, but I tagged it, so let's get out there. Oh, something just hit me. I don't think I ever finished my conversation. Yes, I am recording this episode on November 3rd, but you guys won't see it until the 13th. But, um, I am planning a Throwback Thursday series, which will mean Construction Simulator would have to be moved to Wednesday so that way throwback Thursday can still be on Thursday or it wouldn't be able to be called throwback Thursday but um, but since I have recorded one of the jobs of construction simulator in three parts part three would be on the 21st so it would be the week following and I'm not near a good enough calendar to tell you guys about that but um, I will flash it up on the bottom of the screen in editing because I can take a look at a calendar then so look for it uh, at the bottom of the screen during my talking here um, But um, I will also flash up a date that I do plan on starting the Throwback Thursday uh, series, which would be the 28th, actually, because, yeah. Okay, but I'll still throw up the date anyway, just because I told you I would. I still I will still do it. Um, Thursday throwback Thursday will be starting on November 28th um, just what I am DC you know if am I gonna visit 15 17 19 uh, you know take another map from 19 or well no because I already did one throwback Thursday but 96,932 pounds 
from 26,000 liters of soybeans? Wow. Okay, cool. I I ain't barking at that. I am not barking. But yeah, um, Thursday the 28th, if my plus 7 for the week is... Uh, math is accurate. Uh, the following Thursday, the 28th of November, would be the start of Throwback Thursday. Um, I like I said, I don't know. Am I going to visit 17, 15? I can't rightly say do another map on 19 because the first one I did was FS20, not 19. So, I don't know. I did want to do a mobile because I have not played 18 yet, but... There was something I wanted to do before I even attempted to play mobile. Yes, I know I could do it on my phone, the same one that I do 23 on, but it's just not, space-wise is probably not going to be a good idea, because I got so much other things on my phone right now. Well, and besides that phone doesn't work anymore, it's not activated. So it's kind of like a mini tablet, if you will. But I do want to get my idea first before I even attempt 18, but if I can't, I mean, I already have uh, 15, 17, and 19 for the P you know, PS4, so I'll probably just do up one of those and pick a goal and go for it. Uh, let's see, what are we going to do when we get back here? That's the next question. Well, first of all, we can turn this around, drop it there. Get the Massey out of the way. Because then we can take this. Actually, I don't know. We don't have that much straw. We can... Because I really don't want to use all that big stuff unless we're doing like a contract. Because that's mainly for what I got that uh, front end pickup for. So we can go and collect this straw. And take it over to the silo. I know it's not going to be very much. And now that we are in this area, after we drop this off, we can see how much hay we have. And then when we get out there, because I really don't know if I actually filled the other one of, of their uh, static mixers that we got up with silage yet. I think I did, but we can always check when we get out there. Did all the grass get done? Um, did I? Oh, you know, um... I may have forgotten to do something here. <laughs> Um, oh no, I did. Okay. So is it's automatically doing it, right? Because, yeah, all we had to do was activate it. Okay, guess what? I hit the wrong button. Um... Anyone up for strike two? Yep. 
yeah I think that one looks a little better but yeah uh, we can take this out to the static mixers and then I think oh how much straw did we have just under 8800 liters ah, that's not gonna be enough we can always check the job board after we get this done all right mixer number one this is the second one we bought because our first one there didn't have an extension on it so we got this one so now we have two of them working away you do that let me check this because I highly doubt okay no silage in that one So let's take this back to the take this back to the silo, get out the noise there. Good lord those things are loud. And uh, drop this hay off and see how much silage we have. Bring that in. I didn't even see how much, if it was like 12,000, 14,000, whatever liters, 1,000 liters. Oh well, we'll find out. Hey, going in. Okay, we have that much silage. But how much do we need to... Do, uh, we'll do okay 13,000 13,000 18 liters I'm sure we're going to be bringing some back let's see how much are you going to take 12,000 okay cool Now we can put this back into the silo. And then, like I said, uh, hit up our little buy station for some straw. Now I know I do want to at least get enough straw to fill up the uh, mixers over there. But yes, since I did buy the straw, I do have over 30,000 liters so we will be bringing a small amount back with us that we can throw into the silo are filled up now when I get my PC upgraded I I do I still don't know how to get a hold of people you know like email or direct message whatever because um, if I actually knew a way I'd get a hold of DJ say hey um, show me how or can you uh, upgrade capacities on these things on those mixers back there yeah I mean I love mixers like that dearly so that way I'm not messing with bales but I just wish the capacity was bigger And in a lot of cases, you know, at minimum 50,000 liter capacity, you know. You know, nothing too crazy, but nothing too skimpy either. Alright, we got that done. We can take and park this 
oh wherever I had it over here sounds good and we really don't have much to I'll be doing right now like I said another sleep and then we can um, be cutting grass we do have silage in there we do have hay We do have plenty of bales uh, up in our storage building there that kind of disappeared because I'm out of the view there. There you go. We do have plenty of bales up there for the sheep. Um, yeah, but I think I think the grass fields will be ready in another sleep or two. Well, for a ready to harvest stage, another sleep, but yeah. Huh. Well, anyways, I'm going to end the video here. No sense of having too much fun in one episode, right? <laughs> but anyway, um, in the next episode, we'll take a look at the contract list and see what's going on. See if we can't uh, shove any more straw in that silo. Um, I don't know when we'll sleep, but it's not going to be between, be between this episode and next. But, you know, it could be actually be in the next episode. Who knows? But anyhow, um, I'll end the video here. We'll look off this direction just because I don't know what to do here. Um, but you guys take care of yourselves. I'll see you in the next video. I'm out. Peace.